been cruising these canals now for 38 years uh, and this is the first time we've ever not been cruising the canals and I felt like you know a, a lot of the residents are just used to it it's just there you know, they come out on their patio or something they know a gondolier is going to come by and they might be getting some sort of music and they entertain guests you know although we're not entertaining guests now but they, they got used to it and uh, and then the other side was is how do I keep my gondoliers working? Can I? How can I have them work in some fashion, though we don't have any customers? And I thought we'll combine those two things. We'll get these gondoliers out here; they'll get work, and the residents will be back to normal with their uh, with the sounds of the canal of what it normally sounds like. Yeah, because it's been about four, about to be four weeks. I think, I think four weeks. Yeah. Maybe a little less, but yeah, people like it. People really appreciate it. It kind of it catches a lot of people off guard, but. Um, Honestly, it's been it's been really fun because people are like, "Well, this that's awesome." You know, can you sing this song? I'm like, "Yeah, of course, I got you." You know, and I love to sing, so you know, any chance I get to just sing and be out here and row is fun for me. And every time I come out here, it seems like a, it's almost like I'm getting to know the residents so much more, like personally. Like I feel a lot closer to them in general now. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. helped keep me happy and sane through this whole thing and if I can give back to people with something that I'm so passionate about which is singing then heck yeah I'll do it. It's hope. It's lovely. It makes me happy. The first night that we moved in we were out here eating dinner and they came by and started singing under the bridge and I was like you know it's like home we're home. It's changed where all of a sudden the the res they're singing to the residents. And we've never really done that. It's always been to to them and they're on the side. I'm maybe sometimes embarrassed to listen. Oh, if we're not on the boat, we shouldn't really be doing it. Now they're out on the railing or on their balcony and they're clapping and cheering or requesting and it's like theirs now, which is I didn't I didn't see that coming, but that's one of the things that's happened. They, be, they come by at about 6 o'clock or 7 o'clock at night, so well, it's sad because there isn't anybody in there. So, yeah, but it's nice to hear them. And the kids are back in the water and summer is here, so it's it's been a good thing. It's been a good thing. I'm going to sing a song if you guys would like to listen. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Cool. Sur mare luccica l'astro d'argento flaci dai l'onda prospera il vento Sur mare luccica l'astro d'argento flaci dai l'onda prospera il vento Venite alla gira It is definitely something that you can't just pick up and then be good at it. It takes time. There's a lot of different things and it's humbling. You know, it's uh, it's it's an art to row, to Venetian row. Well, we got a rotation of probably six uh, that rotate in and out. You know, normally I've got 25. You know, we haven't got any government assistant assistance yet and if I had, you know, from the payroll protection, 
I would have got every gondolier down here and every gondolier out here rowing and singing every night, whether we had customers or not. Because. But it's been so um, satis uh, satisfying to hear the responses uh, from both the gondoliers and the um, uh, and the residents. It's worked out good. Um, do you see the sign? Which sign? Okay, when you go out, right there in the, the point, right by my house. Right in the corner, right there. Yeah. yeah. There's a big sign. That it says, says what? Thank you, gondoliers. Oh really? Yeah, oh. Lynn, Lynn next door to me ah. did that. Oh, I haven't seen it, it yet. Yeah. Oh my God, that's awesome.